It's been a hot minute since I've done one of these like vlog update state of the stream sort of thing. So why don't we get to one, shall we? All right, first off, if this is the first time you ever see me, what's up? I'm Eagle Falcon, variety streamer at twitch.tv slash Eagle Falcon. I do a lot of RPG streams, variety streams, and I've uh, been doing a uh, unhealthy amount of Final Fantasy 14. All right, that's that out of the way. Let's talk about the state of the stream. The schedule has been inconsistent. This should not be a surprise to anyone. The primary cause for this, though, is one that I've talked about a bit, but um, let's kind of get a recap for everyone and why things are changing. So at the beginning of the year, one of my drivers left. And actually, he was a great guy. I actually, I was still, still good friends with him, et cetera, et cetera. You know, fantastic guy, but he, he got a better job offer and, you know, I couldn't match the offer. It just is what it is. It's, it's kind of hard for delivery truck driver money that isn't CDL to uh, compete with being a computer technician. It, it's, it's hard to compete with that kind of money, but you know, it is what it is. Um, the next hardest thing was to actually find applicants. And we had a bit of a roller coaster for a while. And there actually was a moment where it looked like we were going to have no drivers, that the only person that was able to do deliver, deliver routes was me. In the state of the place I work at, I am kind of the lead administrator. I am the owner. I do all the payroll. I answer all the emails. I do customer support for all the commercial accounts. I do all the billing. I do all the bills. I do all the unfun stuff when it comes to running a business. So I'm like the backup, backup driver. Like I'm, I'm supposed to be last string, but because we've been shorthanded, I've had to be first string for, um, for a route. And actually when I had COVID, there was just routes that weren't getting done. And we actually had um, the previous owner come in who is retired by the way. I had to beg him practically say, hey, I need your help because I am infectious and I cannot go to these clinics and do the deliveries. It, it, it was a nightmare. It has been an incredibly, incredibly stressful start of the year. And the entire time, we have had signs in every window saying driver wanted. We couldn't get anyone to apply except for maybe a few here's and there's. And a lot of them were either A, overqualified, or B, we're looking for a very specific um, kind of delivery schedule, which we couldn't accommodate. Like my personal favorite was actually one who was a former CDL ho holder that uh, wanted to do basically daytime delivery shift, which if you don't know what that is, that's basically between two and 6 a.m. before the retail outlets open. None of our clinics are open at that. None, none of our commercial customers are open at that, at that time. We couldn't make deliveries at that time, even if we wanted to. So we had to turn them down. There's a lot of others that are just like, just unqualified. Another guy was like, had a criminal record as long as my arm, specifically for stealing vehicles. <sighs> But even with all these bad applicants, there was just a strong lack of applicants. And so I have been working hard to make sure that everything held together as much as possible. That's why a lot of streams just didn't happen because I ended up staying late and or by the time I got home, there was nothing left in the tank. Heck, um, last week's uh, P9S uh, Savage Raid, the moment the lights went out, I'd like face planted on the keyboard. I was that exhausted. And like I could feel a bit of fatigue going in, trying to understand the mechanics we were about to do and whatnot. It, it did not hit until, why, am, why is the camera flickering? Why is the camera brighter than normal too? 
I'm sorry for that. I have no idea why it's doing that. It's being weird. What if I do this? Are you going to behave now? Not really, no. I don't know why it's doing that. Maybe it's just my display window. Maybe it's actually, like, fine. Nope, it's definitely flickering. And I definitely need to shave. That's not good for taking a lazy day. Anyway, uh, I digress. So, what has changed? Last week, I got three applicants. All three of which, oddly enough, former retirees. I don't know why, but it just is. So, whoops. So, I looked over all three. I took the the best of the of the three. I've hired them. I'm now training them. So far, they appear to be a very, very good fit. To which, super stoked, finally. So, what does that mean for me? It means I can have a more consistent schedule. It means I can go back to just being the, admin the administrator. Going back to actually managing the company like I should be. Which means things for the stream should be more consistent. On top of all that, I don't know how, but somehow I managed to actually f fix my sleep schedule. Actually getting up at a decent hour rather than a lot of waking up right at like 9.30 a.m. and having to like immediately hit the shower and immediately hit the road in a zombie-like state, which is not healthy for me, and it's especially not healthy for everyone else on the road. And so I already made a announcement on the Discord, but we are also going to be changing up the stream schedule. So the way I've always done it was Monday, Wednesday, Thursday was viewer vote nights. Then we switched Monday to a my choice night. And then Saturday and Sunday was podcast and Final Fantasy 14. Here's how it's actually going down now. Mondays will be the primary viewer vote game, which is currently Disgaea 2. We still need to start it. Tuesday will be Final Fantasy XIV Savage Rating. I put down Omni Job later, but that's only because that's going to be our short day because we lose uh, we lose Scrubs pretty early due to WoW Rating. Wednesday, also Final Fantasy XIV Savage Rating. Thursday is our second viewer vote game. I, I said primary earlier. It's like A and B, which is currently Pokemon Arceus. Friday is my day off. And that will be the new reset point of the week. For the purpose of the stream schedule. So that'll be when I write up the schedule. That'll be when it's posted, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Saturday will be Eagle Eyes on Tech. And it will be my current choice of the game or any sub goal that needs to be met. Currently, it is Advanced Wars Reboot Camp. We are, I'd say, two days away from finishing it. Maybe three, depending on how much I want to unlock on stream. Then we have uh, Final Fantasy V and Six Picks Remaster to finish. And then we finally have to get to, um, yeah, Forbidden Memories. You guys all hit that sub goal. We need to make sure it happens. It's going to be great. And then Sunday will be our primary Final Fantasy XIV Savage rating day, as well as Omni Job and Silly Things on FF14 before and after, possibly. So that is the current schedule. We'll see how that goes for a couple of weeks. There may be some days that get axed. We might bring it down to just one viewer vote night. Um... There's also the what happens when the Savage tier is done. Because here's the thing. Eventually, we're now more seasoned into, in doing Savage. We're no longer rookies in this. So what happens after this tier is done? 
There's not another ultimate coming out. We may go back do other ultimates. We may go back and do uh, silly things. I know uh, Coils of Bahamut synced was kind of half jokingly thrown out there. I wouldn't mind doing that. So we'll see. It may come down to those knights become more casual. It's hard to say. We have eight months to do this Savage tier. Ideally, I'd like to see it done before football season. But that's just me being hopeful. Um, YouTube stuff. I am working on YouTube, on YouTube clips right now. As you're watching this, if you're watching this on the same day it's going up. Uh, clips should start flowing again. I want to... If I can get a lot of them done, I want to try and do a two a day cycle for a bit. They'll probably go back down to one until well, I mean, once this new guy's trained, I'll have more time to do clips. So I don't know. They'll probably still, still stick to one a day down the road, but I want to try and get two just because I still I am like a month and a half behind now on clips. We still have some uh, P8S tier. We still have some P8S clips, and we need to get them out and done. But I also do plan on having um, some other videos coming up. The MSQ stuff I want to split into a few, few videos. The normal raids I want to split up into a few videos. Just you know, some some good stuff all around. So that is what I have planned. I it's for once it's actually looking up. Like, usually when I've had these vlogs, it's like, I'm tired. I'm burned out. Also, life sucks. Also, all this, that, and the other things going on. Oh, my God. There's so much work to do. The things are finally starting to look up, and that's saying something for a guy who currently doesn't have a car. Yeah, I'm still waiting to hear back for, about my transmission. I'm borrowing one of the work trucks. I'm going to borrow my dad's van soon, too, just because... Uh, or my dad's... uh. SUV soon just cuz um this truck out here has uh, squealing brakes and that's going to need to, and that's going in on Tuesday. So we're going to have to get a rental for work and then I'm going to need some way to get home. Which is great. So still a mess, but things are looking up and there actually was a lot of concern when I first announced this on the Discord about uh well what about um what about personal life? What about what if you need some me days? If I need some me days, I'll either just end streams early on the weekend. We'll just do a pre-announce sort of thing. Or uh, we'll reevaluate down the road. But for the first time in a while, I don't feel like I'm like burning myself out at work in order to keep things holding still. It, it, the thing is that my job, like I said, it's not like a normal job where you can just be like, well, that's not my problem. And then just not let it be my, pro be your problem. No, I'm the last guy in the chain. If there's a problem, it is now my problem. There is no one left to put it to, and I've got to deal with it. It's fun, TM. But finally, it's starting to calm down. Things are looking up, and I, for one welcome it so take care rest well we'll see you next time